Alright, I've been doing a lot of research about GPU qualifications with Media Composer and I have in my machine a GTX 570 which I bought a few years ago and today I actually decided to um, enable it and put it into the uh, qualified GPU boards to see if it would work and basically uh, you know to see if I could get a quote-unquote qualified card in there so I went in and I did what everybody else is doing and I typed in Nvidia Corp GTX 570 Nvidia 570 I'm using the latest driver 353.30 and I am on Media Composer 8.4 so I have the latest and greatest version woo alright so I'm gonna fire up Media Composer see what we get so it's starting up GPU detected alright so it worked my 570 graphics card worked in there I'm gonna fire up a project it was a short film I was cutting. Mine was finished last year, but for the purpose of this video, I just want to um, make sure everything works. So I'm going to go to Tools, Console, and I'm going to type in <clears throat> type in ACPL um, GPU effects right there. CPL GPU effects and I'm gonna hit that Ooh. I'm gonna hit enter and there it is ACPL GPU effects are currently enabled and if I scroll up um, you will see I have the NVIDIA GTX 570 running the latest drivers and I'm good to go. I also have 32 gigs of RAM on this machine. The processor is not the bus. This pretty old processor. It's a quad co quad core something. I don't remember, but it's overclocked slightly to about 3.6 gigahertz. So that is that. Um, I'm actually gonna buy myself a GTX. The video stop, but I was gonna say I'm gonna get the GTX 980 Ti um, it was either that or getting a quadro card but I don't know they're just not that powerful you know compared to the price range um, of these GeForce cards and the thing is if I could go in and, and input the card into Avid and it's gonna recognize it as a certified card then why not go with just like a GTX or um, you know GTX GeForce card I mean or anything like that um, it just makes more sense for the money and I think I'm gonna wait till 2016 and see what Nvidia comes up with with the new Quadro series maybe I'll pick up a Quadro down the line the new versions but I think a 980 is gonna be pretty good for me for now um, like I said I, I work professionally as in post and um avid's the my number one program but i am cutting a feature on premiere so those cuda cores will definitely help all right thanks for watching um i might make also a video i'm gonna make a video doing step by step for the gtx when it comes in the nine the 980 ti when it comes in i'll definitely uh do that video as well all right, and let you guys know what's going on. I might have to return it if nothing works on it. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Thanks.